to another episode of Redline Racing Garage. Uh, today, I'm just working on prepping the uh, RSX. Um, I checked the coolant level, I checked the oil level, checked the tire pressure, uh, torqued down the bolts uh, a bit just to make sure. And we are also prepping the uh, trailer, getting that all ready as well. So as you can tell by the title of this video, we are going on a track day today. So we're going uh, doing some lapping with the RSX. So pretty much for here, I got uh, some cherry cans for some uh, for gas. I uh, got my helmet in here, got the jack. I still got to put some jack stands, uh, bringing our little machine here. Um, I do have the, uh, let me see, where's the key? I do have the generator all oiled up as well and gassed up. I did start it and everything is working well. I also have just some oil, engine oil just in case. So stuff like that. So that's all ready to go. So yeah, uh, what I'm gonna do is uh, I wanna get the RSX uh, washed up. I gotta get the truck washed as well. And then after we do that, I'm gonna start by loading up uh, the RSX, strapping it down, and we're gonna go to uh, the track, do some laps, so stay tuned, guys. All right, guys, so we got the RSX washed, we got the truck washed, the RSX is loaded up, strapped down, ready to go. So we are about to leave. <laughs> So we made it here to Toronto Motorsport Park. Finally got here. It's been a mission. We've been uh, trying to get here for quite a while. Uh, there was only a limit of 30 drivers today. So luckily uh, we got in and it is now sold out. So I'm thinking I was probably the last or the second last one to get in. So that worked out great. So yeah, we are parked over here and we're just gonna get ready to unload the RSX right now. So we're gonna start by unstrapping it. We're gonna unload it to get it all ready. And by around five o'clock, which is in about 15 minutes, we should be able to start to get on the track, do a little shakedown lap or two and uh, see how that goes. So finally, like I told you guys, I am really excited to give you guys some uh, racing content. So here we go. pressure check check the oil check the coolant check the bolts torque them down just to make sure and we are ready to go all 
Alright guys, here we go.
Then we gotta time ourselves. Just two quick little shakedown passes just to kind of get the feel of the track. I'm gonna let it cool down for a bit. And then we're going right back at it again. This time I'm gonna set my timer on my iPhone and then see what kind of time we can get. Right after the white Civic, please.
so we did do three laps uh, that time um, I was too carried away and I didn't really uh, calculate one lap how much I did in the one lap so I did the three the timer was still going and uh, I just divided that by three so whatever time I got and we got an average of about 2.16 so still that's an average like I said I did get a little carried away uh, what I'm gonna do now is uh, when uh, we let the car cool down and we're gonna go back out there we're going to actually do one lap timer just to see what time I have and then we can start working on shaving that time off as we go but yeah guys lots of fun uh, there's still a lot more to come uh, we just got started so stay tuned all right guys so round three uh, this time I'm gonna do just one lap and uh, see what type of uh, lap time I can get and then go from there.
I did another three laps but I did um, get one lap time precisely so the lap time that I have is 1.40.02 so that's pretty much our lap time and uh, I'm gonna try and shave that uh, lap time off as much as I can another thing that uh, I have to get is a actual timer like it's a little digital timer you put on your dash and you can just push it it's much more uh, better than using your iPhone it's much more accurate so I think that's what we have to uh, get ASAP if you want to continue uh, doing circuits and continue shaving off the lap time and getting precise lap times I think that's what we have to do but yeah lots of fun so that was round three uh, overall I did get about I'd say nine to ten laps already so just letting this uh, thing cool down and then we can get back on it again uh, starting to smell the clutch starting to smell the brakes the tires all that stuff so I am a drag guy I mostly like to do drag um, but this is kind of fun circuits uh, is fun as well um, it does take more strain like the car does take a lot more abuse on a circuit than a drag I would think um, but yeah that's pretty much the plan we had with this RSX I like I told you guys from the beginning I'm gonna use this RSX for uh, circuits and we're here and that's what we're doing uh, I hope you guys uh, enjoy the video so far uh, I still have some time to do a little bit more laps but that's pretty much what we have in store for today I'm really excited that we did come here and uh, did do some laps like i said we've been trying to get out here for a while now so it's really good that we're here and i'm really glad that i can give you guys uh these uh videos so i really appreciate it so stay tuned we got more to come all right guys so the car is uh, cooled down and we are ready to go back out there again let's see if we can uh shave our lap time uh down a little bit better
is 135.38 so we did shave off almost five seconds off the last lap which is really really good going at it again got everything loaded up and I'm heading home right now today was a really good day uh, I'm really glad to uh, share some racing content with you guys I've been uh, wanting to get this uh, racing content on my channel and finally we got some uh, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, please be sure to like comment and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one take it easy